This is 911 Countdown. New World Order. Faith. Faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. Is people out here don't want you to believe that this is going on. They don't want you to believe that uh, New World Order is, is just a, a fairy tale, but the banks are involved. Big businesses are involved. Oil people are involved. You know, it's called, it's like communism. The UN order is more, it's communism. Big Brother is watching you. RFID, that's not no joke. They can hear, know everything about you. There's nothing to be paranoid. You know, it's about, they want to know about every crime, criminal activity, know about what's going on. And people want you to think it's a joke and it's not going on. Just like slavery. When they started slavery, they thought, oh, well, we're just going over there to have fun with the people. Oh, no, it's going over. Going down for real. Population control. Whatever they can do, whatever they can do to get your butt, your way out, is to become global in your thinking, global in the things that you want and desire. Keep your faith in God. Because Jesus is returning. It's all about his return. As the days of Noah, so should be my last days. Everybody think everything is everything fine, everything going on. They think, you know, bam. New world order. New world order. One government, one religion, one order. No more BET. No more none of this stuff making the millions of dollars. Uh-uh. It's communism. It's not going on no more. Uh, everything playing a role. They already know. Man-made flood, what happened with Trina? Okay, the flood that you got going on right now. Of course, we know it's about Jesus' return. It's causing all this. Happen. But man is playing a role as well. But God has already calculated this in his whole plan. That's why Jesus walked the earth the first time. It was hell like it is right now. But it, even worse now. That's why Jesus is going to return. He's going to return for all this, everything that's going on, uh, just good, bad, and evil. He's going to set up his, right here, reign on earth. After we leave this body, we go to our eternal body. And we come back here and reign with him, you know, forever and ever. People don't want to make it, you know, they think, like, that's not real. You know, Jesus not real. There's no God. There's only just hell right here. But Jesus is real, and he's returning. But all those that's going through that's been hurt, been in pain, Lost of loved ones, you know, hurt, lost a job, you know, caught up in the floods, you know, uh, can't see a way, there's no way, you know. We give you a small prayer right now. God, in the name of Jesus, help those that's been hurt, caught up in the floods, just, just been, you know, just lost loved ones, mama, daddy, sister, brother, wife, friend, you know, God, strengthen them right now in Jesus' name. Give them strength right now, Lord. Give them strength. Give them strength. Something that Muhammad can't do. Buddha can't do. Hinduism can't do. But you can do it, Jesus. Strengthen them right now. God, give them the mind to go on. Give them a determined mind, God, that they can make it, that they can stand in the hurt, in the pain, in the loss, in the discomfort, God. Comfort them right now. In your name, Jesus. In your name. In your name, Jesus. Give them comfort. In your name, Lord. Let it be so. Amen. And as we always say when we leave here, your future is brighter than your past. Past hurt, past pain, past regrets. Even in your presence, your future is brighter. And keep your mind on things above that everything down here is just eternal. And don't let it shake you. Stand strong, keep your head up, and keep living. Living your life to the best of your ability, and leave a legacy, leave a legacy, whether it's uh, uh, something that you want to do in the church world, something that you want to leave here, you know, do for the homeless, give, give of yourself, help, you know, love, later for the haters, the haters come and go, you know, you got to fight them off, bam, 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 as we always say, with the word of God, and keep going, God will take care of them, you know, as he always say, the battle is not ours, it's his, he'll get them, you know, be strong. If you get cancer, any kind of sickness, be strong. In Jesus' name, this is 911 countdown. Keeping you encouraged. Be strong.
It's not over yet. 